the indicator on your instrument will appear red when your calibration is expired. In Color IQC or Color Eye Match, the status bar will also show the remaining time of your calibration. Calibration is initiated through your software. A different calibration mode will need to be created for each configuration you'll be using. This consists of a measurement mode, specular condition, UV filter position, port aperture and lens size, as well as a few additional settings. Each calibration mode can be named to allow you to easily identify it. Before calibrating your instrument, make sure your optics area, white calibration tile, and black trap are all free of dust or dirt, as that can dramatically affect your calibration. Refer to the video on cleaning your instrument to learn more. To calibrate your instrument in reflectance measurement mode, first make sure the correct aperture plate is installed for your calibration mode. Select the mode you wish to calibrate and click the Calibrate button. A calibration can also be triggered by clicking this icon in your application toolbar. Remove the white calibration tile from the accessory drawer and position it on the sample holder so that the white ceramic side is facing the aperture plate. The white tile serial number should always be on top to ensure repeatability. Initiate the measurement from your software. After the measurement is complete, return the tile to your accessory drawer. Next, you will be asked for a black trap measurement. Remove the black trap from your accessory drawer and position it on the aperture plate so that the tab on the top edge of the black trap aligns with the notch at the top of the plate. Initiate the measurement from your software. After the measurement is complete, return the black trap to your accessory drawer. Once calibration is complete, the instrument's calibration light becomes green. Your status bar will also update with the time left before another calibration is needed.